A northeastern Indiana high school guidance counselor is under fire and could lose her job. But nobody from the South Madison Community School Corporation will say why. Tonight, 13 News reporter Emily Longnecker has an explanation. Well, the guidance counselor's name is Kathy McCord, and she's worked here at Pendleton Heights High School for more than 20 years. But now her future with the district is up in the air. A spokesperson from McCord says she was put on administrative leave in January after the longtime guidance counselor spoke to an online publication that's part of the Heritage Foundation, a conservative think tank. In December, McCord told the publication the school district has a gender support plan for students who are questioning their gender identity. Parents who've attended recent school board meetings and spoken against McCord's suspension say they weren't aware such a plan existed. A copy of the minutes from the school district's December school board meeting show the superintendent confirmed the district had a gender support plan for students, but it was not on the district's website. This mom says it's her understanding that in the plan, students have the option of whether they want their parents to know they'd like to use a different name or pronoun at school that's different from their gender assigned at birth. A spokesperson from McCord says the guidance counselor believes parents should be notified. And while I would like to think that I know everything about my kids, I also would hope that a school would let me know if there was something that I needed to know. We reached out to the superintendent to get the school district side of the issue. We did not hear back. Coming up tonight at 6, the bill that the Indiana General Assembly is debating right now that deals with this very issue and what it could mean if it becomes law.